everybody. I want to go over the three, six, and ten that I asked you to do yesterday. So I'm going to run through those real fast for you. So the three and the seven I multiply because they're regular numbers and the parentheses are smushed. So three times seven is 21. The exponents I add because it's the first rule. When you multiply same bases, add exponents. So negative five plus 13 is eight. And two plus negative six is negative four. But I can't leave something with a negative exponent, so this b is gonna drop to the denominator. So b goes down, the exponent switches to a positive four, 21 stays put, and the eight of the eighth stays put, and that's number three. Okay, hopefully those of you who did it yesterday, you did really well, and you're getting this. Okay, number six. So everything is getting raised to that outside exponent. Now this three is not an exponent, so that three is getting raised to the third power. Three times three times three, which is 27. But these guys are all getting raised to the outside exponent and they're all exponents. So that's the third line of the song. If there's a power to a power, then you multiply that. So negative seven times three is negative 21. 3 times 3 is 9, and 5 times 3 is 15. And then Mr. W, you got to move. So the W is going to drop to the denominator. The exponent will switch to a positive 21. The X stays put, and the Y stays put. And that's our answer, and we're done. Okay, and then number 10. So here I have division. So the 9 and 27 are just regular numbers, so I am going to divide them. But 9 doesn't divide by 27 um, nicely, so 9 divided by 27 reduces to 1 third. And then exponents you subtract. When you divide, you have to subtract. So 8 minus 2, that makes 6. Negative 3 minus 6, that makes negative 9. Put it in your calculator if you have to. Negative 3 minus 6. Six. And then there's a one here, so one minus negative four, that makes five. So who has to move? The y. So one third gets written like that. The x stays put, the y drops, the exponent switches to a positive nine, and the z stays put. So this is what you should have got for your work for the three, six, and ten that I asked you to do yesterday. Okay, hopefully you're feeling really good about these problems. All right, so what I'm asking you to do for me today is to um, take a quiz is, and uh, let's see if we can see this. All right, so here we are, and I have a quiz is that I want you to take, but this time you only have one time to take it. So you need to be ready to take it as soon as you start. Some of you um, on the first few quizzes, um, you let the whole quiz play and you didn't answer any questions. Okay, so um, this time you only have one chance to take it. We've been working on uh, laws of exponents for a week and a half, so you should know what you're doing by now. All right, then when you're done, I want you to take a picture of your score and I want you to post it to Canvas. I want to see your name in your picture though. So when you um, log into your quiz is, it asks for your name or it might already have it typed there. So when you take your picture of your score, I wanna see your picture of your name also. Okay, so I should see your name in the picture. All right, and that's all for today, everybody. Smiley face.